Hi everyone, welcome back to the my channel. My name is Anil, and in this Laravel 7 video tutorial, we will learn about the middleware. And this is the second part. If you did not watch our previous video, then you can just get the link from the description box. So these are the points of the video. So first of all, we will just review our last video. Uh, it should be a video, all right? Then we will see the what is the grouped middleware and the routed middleware and write some code. In the last video, we will learn about the glo global middleware. So let's check out the previous video. So first of all, we actually make a middleware with the command of uh, PHP partition make middleware. So this is our middleware basically. Then we register it in the kernel for the global middleware, right? Then we make a no access blade template so that we can just show it the uh, another or we can just redact our uh, middleware to the uh, some other file. And in the web.php, we just define the route for no access page after that we will just put the condition if age is less than 20 then it, it will just redirect to the no access page right perfect so now let's continue with the uh, this video and we will uh, see that what is basically the grouped middleware all right so basically grouped middleware means uh, let's say you have the 100 routes and you just want to put the middleware only on some specific routes only 50 routes or 60 route or specifically on some uh, module like you just you don't want to access some profile setting uh, routes at all all right then you can basically use the group routing all right so now let's see that how we can use the group routing first of all uh, as you know in the last video we just register our middleware in the global array but now we don't need to put here put it here so now let's get it and just apply it in a grouped middleware and let's make a middleware for it first of all so i am just going to middleware with the name of let's say custom auth right and then let's take an array and put this inside an array right so now you have a different group the name with the custom auth and this uh, you are registered here that means uh, all of the custom custom auth group will access this middleware right that how we can this access for that we just have to go in the web.php file and just make a um, you can say that a group of the routes here for that just write here route and this route will have a group method and this group method will take an array and here you can just write the middleware name in an array and middleware name like uh, this and here we can also take an array because maybe in the same middleware we have a more than one group so just write here custom auth for uh, reducing the error possibility i'm just going to copy it from here to here perfect and now you just have to need to put the second array and the, the sec, uh, second parameter and second parameter will take a callback function and here you can define your routes so basically in this middleware i am just going to define the welcome route right so if i am just going to put it like this and let's put a colon here now let's see uh, are we able to uh, access this page or not with the same condition if our age is more than 20 or equal to 20 then we are able to access this welcome page otherwise we are not able to access all right and um, just after this example i'm just going to show you that how we can just put the more than one route also right so now if i'm just going to put here age is more than 30 then we are easily able to access it if i'm just going to put it here only three then you will see there is a no access right so because the group is applied on our route so if i am just going to comment it out and let's open it then this will where custom auth is not applied on the welcome and we can just access this anywhere so if i am just going to put here age 2 then we are able to access it right so now because this url is not present in the group so now let's try with the one more url all right so I am just going to make one more view like profile dot blade dot php. Alright. And just write here users 
profile page and uh, let's just make copy of it and put it inside it first of all let's put it outside and just write a profile and just make it profile let's try to access it now you can see we are able to access and now let's put the age 2 but we are still able to access because middleware is not applied here now let's copy it from outside to inside our middleware mm -mm. like this and uh, now let's try as you can see that we are able to get the no access page let's try again with the age of 20 now we can access let's put here some lessees like 10 then we cannot access it all right this is perfect fine now at the last point let's see that how uh, a routed middleware is actually works now uh, now actually i just want to apply the route on some uh, middleware on some specific route not all of them all right so how we can i do this so first of all i am just going to comment this code and uh, let's access this code here and also access this page like this and like this also right because now we are able to access everything so for the routed middleware we let's again we have to go inside the kernel file and let's get it from here our uh, middleware path and just registered it in the route middleware with the name of a uh, routed middleware so let's say i am just going to put here um, custom route auth all right and uh, let's take array and just put it here perfect now this is our custom route middleware for uh, let's come back to the web.php now you can see that you are able to access every page let's say profile page 2 we are able to access it there is no restriction and profile also have accessible there is no restrictions now let's we have to reduction uh, restriction only on the profile page with the routed middleware for that let's come here and just choose here like this mm, like this just put here middleware and middleware name so my middleware name is uh, custom route auth and just put it like directly here right so i hope middleware spelling is fine no okay now this is perfect let's come back here and now to access this page now you can see that we are not able to access because route is applied here so let's say try to apply again uh, mm -mm. profile and case is 20 this is able to access we are able to access it so this is the way that how you can just use the routed uh, middleware and uh, a group middleware if you still have any kind of confusion you can ask me in the comment box don't forget to subscribe my channel and like this video bye bye take care